Hey everybody, Justice Good here, and in this tutorial I'm going to show you how to create an old style photo effect. So as you can see, this will transform your photos from regular photos to an old looking, dirty and grungy photo. So from that to this. All we're going to be using is a texture and a few simple adjustment layers in Photoshop. And the whole thing should take a few minutes. So let me delete all these layers and start from scratch so you can follow me create the effect. The first thing you want to do is find a texture of some old paper or some dust or scratched paper on the internet. I'll add some links in the description box of where to find these. So once you find this, drag it on your photo and of course make sure it's big enough to fit without stretching it and position it and rotate it how you like. Once you find a position that you like head over to image adjustments and go to desaturate because we want to take the color out of this paper now go to image adjustments and head over to levels drag the middle slider to the right and the furthest slider to the left a little bit this way we have a more contrasted texture and then set it to overlay of course you should adjust the levels and positioning on what works best with your picture this is what I think works best with my picture. Now head over to New Adjustment Layer and select Gradient Map. The gradient map you want to use is this brown to white. If you want the exact brown color that I'm using, I'm using 311F00. And of course, just a regular solid white. So once you find a good brown to white color, go ahead and select OK. Now we're going to color the white of this photo a little more by using a new adjustment layer, Photo Filter. And as for the filter, we're going to select Deep Yellow. Select a density of about 30 to 40 percent, depending on what works with be best with your picture. I'm going to use 40 percent. And make sure Preserve Luminosity is checked. So once you've selected a good yellow and percentage, create a new layer Grab your rectangular marquee tool and select your entire image. And within your selection, click and select stroke. For the width of the stroke, we're going to use 10 pixels and we're going to use a tan color, like so. I'm using E4C785. For the location, make sure it's inside and select OK and deselect. Now head over to filter, blur, Gaussian blur and for the radius blur it at about 50 pixels to create a faded out look on the edges of your photos set the blending mode of this layer to screen and there you go there's your old style photo effect in a few simple layers of course you should adjust these colors and settings to something that works best with your picture and of course the effect is always going to look different depending on the texture that you use if you enjoyed this tutorial, make sure you check out my channel where I upload tutorials just like this one every week. Don't forget to subscribe and feel free to leave a comment if you have any suggestions for any future tutorials or questions. And if you missed the previous tutorial, check it out. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.